Hello, hello. Vita back with a second reading for today. Let's hop on into these energies, see what else the guys would like for the collective to be aware of today. Oh, what do we have? Enchanter, master number 22. Self-evaluation, awakening, purpose, independence, and confidence. I believe that you are all of these things. You have been doing a lot of self-evaluating in your life, digging very deep. There's some new opportunities that are definitely opening up for you. What are these here? All right. We've got the pack number 38 that breaks down to an 11 community inner work. So again, inner work self-evaluation you've been doing a lot of inner work rebuilding yourself reaching a, a different level in your life in your thinking how you're carrying yourself your walk could even be different you're holding your head up higher there's reason to hold your head up high community deep connection celebration soul tribe you're making new connections and if you're not you are about to there's new energy that's coming forward in your life. Spectrals. Wow, this card's amazing. Discernment, critical thinking, investigation, insight. So there's some sort of investigation that's been going on. It could involve you. There's some oversight. But this feels more like spiritual oversight. Like you're being watched by the gods encouraged to use your discernment you are a critical thinker you do take the time necessary to make certain decisions that you know will affect your life tremendously and quickly rider is a number 12 movement quick decisions progress excitement so there's something that's happening very fast for you you could be feeling quite excited about it i feel like this is career driven but there's also some love going on here what is this crossed choices stuck searching for purpose daydreaming indecision i feel like this is star crossed lover energy coming through someone is doing that stop go stop go they want to come toward you not quite sure how fretting there's a lot of fretting going on nest charity generosity sharing and support you could be working on your home front making things more spectacular doing some deep cleaning um, this helps you think clearly cleaning could help you think more clearly keeping your house very tidy is important getting rid of the clutter opens up the mind what else what other deck do i want to get this pack is interesting what do we have coming out for the pack wolf pack blue is significant blue throat chakra learning to communicate differently as you encounter new energies in your life vibing higher increasing your vibration to attract a lot of different new opportunities the pack Queen of Swords, you're the leader of the pack. Dominant, perceptive, you have very keen in insight. Someone admires your ability to think in numerous ways, not just spiritually, but logically. You're very logical. Someone sees you as very lo logical. Oh, I'm stuttering. So someone does want to speak to you their throat chakra could be a bit clogged up they're nervous this person feels like a star-crossed lover something's happening happening in the ethers spectrals why spectrals here nine of cups is at the bottom look at that eight of wands and this is coming out right before this rider fast movement this could even be online activity spectrals online above investigation 
Someone's looking into you online, could be watching you online. If you're a content creator, if you have a platform, you could be gaining new followers. Spectrals, you could be glowing different. You're glowing different. Something about you is very different. There's a transformation here. Someone wants to come toward you fast. Not sure how. Stuck. Their words are stuck in the throat. Rider. Riding through the storm. Oh, I just saw the moon. It didn't come out, but I just saw it. I know I did. Nope. Yeah. The moon. There's some mystery. Someone sees you as very mysterious. You could be a little bit closed off to someone or something. Rider. Nauseous. Someone's nauseous. Up oh, the moon. It came out. Damn. And then we've got the devil. Oh, man. Come on. Ugh. And then look. We've got this color sink here. Oh, and then we've got the sun. And then that's followed by the hermit. So these are all major arcana. So whatever this is, it's coming. It's coming fast and it's very powerful. This energy is very powerful. Um, the moon and the sun, we've got divine masculine, divine feminine energies here. Someone wants to come toward you fast. You are progressing in ways that might be somewhat unimaginable to you at this time. Some dream of yours is coming to life. There's a dream that you've been building that's coming to life and you can feel it. It's been hidden. Something's been hidden. You've been feeling anxious, maybe even a little bit insecure, but you're coming out of that energy fast, fast. Someone finds you very enchanting. Cage is behind chanting, and then we've got the hangman that flips. So I do feel like you are coming out of a period of uh, dormancy where things just haven't been moving like you expected them to, but now they are. Everything's taken off. Everything's aligning because your vibration continues to rise. But you had to go through this period of stagnation. It was required. The stagnation was re required. Huh. And maybe you fought it. Maybe you maybe you fought it. Maybe you didn't. Maybe you succumbed to the stagnation too much let's keep going oh oh look 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 lovers and ace of cups star cross lovers although this does not say star cross lovers this is the energy that i'm getting from this card and it's a number 13 which is the death card in the tarot so you do have a choice in love you got a choice in love, and someone is doing a lot of daydreaming about you. They're watching you. They're watching you with this eight, eight of wands. There's no communication, but there's about to be a lot of communication. Socializing, celebration. You could be getting some invitations, some party, holiday party invitations. Perhaps from people that you want to see, and maybe some that you don't. You've got choices. You're being gifted. Your heart chakra is expanding. You're opening up to letting new love into your life. The excitement is rising. You can feel it. Toes curling. Someone's going to make your toes curl. You're making someone's toes curl. Whoa. Interesting. So there's a path. That you've crossed with someone and you've both kept going in opp opposite directions with these horns that are like, uh, well, actually, these are like spears coming out here. So, but now there's something that's coming back together. There's a fusion happening. There's a fusion happening after a period of healing, getting rid of all this anxiousness, being stuck in your head, this eight of swords. Fool, so there's someone that's been stuck in their head about you. They're getting ready to gallop. 
they're galloping toward you this could just be energetically at this time they don't want you to get away someone doesn't want you to get away nest they want to build a nest with you why is nest here oh no seven of swords it's clarifying nest and then we've got two of swords here so this is this same energy right here on the fence what is going on with this nest sharing support generosity charity and then with the seven of swords spying so this could simply be spying but it's some sort of uh This could be another energy that wants to uh, come in. So the last reading was picking up on two or three or four energies. There was a lot going on in that last reading. But uh, there's someone that wants to build a nest with you. Their intentions might not be all the way pure. They know how psychic you are. And so they are on the fence as to how to approach you. Or this could simply be strategy. I don't want to always look at this card as like, you know, sneaky, tricky, whatever, but that's usually what it is. Dangerously risky behavior. I don't like that. Let's get the Kipper. Queen of Swords. Courtship. Courtship poverty. So this is about coming together with someone but there's some feelings some mixed feelings could be you on the fence about love new love in general maybe you feel it's not time for you just yet maybe there's some things that you're still working on some introspection that has you caught deep down in your lower chakras, you're working through your lower chakras. That's, I don't know what that is. What's going on there? Yeah, finances. It has to do with your finances. You're cleaning up your house. You're cleaning up your house. Eight of Wands. Gift. And it's sideways. Distant horizon. So... There's some, there's a gift coming to you. It's not yet here. It's in travel mode. It hasn't landed yet from the universe. Ace of Cups from the universe. It's going to be a joyous, there's going to be a time for you to celebrate soon. Distant horizon, wealthy man is in the upright with high honor. So there's someone on the fence about giving you a gift. Okay, got that clear. Spectral investigation, insight, critical thinking, discernment. Maybe this person could be uh, overbearing and they're trying to make some adjustments because they do see you as this queen of swords, someone that can uh, see through a lot and isn't going to be too tolerant of any sort of aggressive behavior or controlling behavior controlling someone wants to gain control of a situation involving you why is the moon here so you're being investigated it's a secret you don't know it but you know it now someone is investigating you moon Wealthy man could be under investigation, false person. Oh, this is turned over. And then we have family room, thief, bad health. So that's interesting. We got wealthy man secretly watching you. Could have been told that you were this false persona or they could be seen as someone who's very false. Could be under investigation, progress, excitement. There's excitement here, though. Could be with the family room in reverse. This 
wealthy man could have left a false person, someone that carried a, uh, just being fake, a fake person, pretentious, wanting people to see them in this high honor when they're really just kind of like greedy and not all that cool. We'll get some more intel. Why is this Ace of Cups here? Landed on the wealthy man, and then we've got journey. So there is movement, change with the wealthy man. Journey, Ace of Cups. Star-crossed lover. Journey, Ace of Cups, concern about a new beginning, concerned about but what has to be left behind to start something new with you. Past life lover just popped in my mind. This is a past life, deep soul connection. Um, you could have made eye, eye contact with this person. And in doing so, there was an ignition of sorts. You could have met this person recently or not. Journey, rider, someone wants to take you on a trip, on a ride. They feel that this new romance that they want to bud and build with you is going to take you both on a really wild ride. And so the excitement continues to build, bubble over. Why is lovers here? Occupation. Clarifying lovers. And then we have house. So this wealthy man could be in the business, the industry of real estate, could be a builder, a developer could be very, um, could, like I said, watching you, occupied with you, may, maybe this is even a job offer, adjudication, message of concern, could be, oh, and then we've got this main male and main female imprisonment. So there is some sort of investigation, legal proceedings involving property, involving a business or several businesses. It could be uh, some sort of fling that was going on in the workplace that had some real dire consequences. Seven of Swords. Whoa. Lovers went that way. And then we have poverty. So there's been a separation, expectation, and despair. So whoever... This, uh, this feels like, I don't know, this could be two energies or just this one energy here. But there's despair. There's a separation. There's more than one lover. There's a few lovers that have been left behind. Maybe this wealthy man energy has carried on with multiple lovers while being in a committed marriage. Everything has come to light. It's cost it is costing this person a lot of money. And so the gift that they want to give to you is in transit. It can't land yet. Thoughts doing a lot of thinking about you for sure. All right, let's get the archetype for... So the only main person energy is this wealthy man that is out well and then we've got the queen of swords which i feel like is you why is this queen of swords here teacher student so you are teaching many through your insight your insight is a uh, guiding perhaps this wealthy man toward you in secret this wealthy man does not want you to know how interested he is in getting to know you but you are teaching this person on a spiritual level why is wealthy man here 
I just had the urge to toss my cards. I don't know what that is. Oh, man, I don't know what this is. Gambler. Someone wants to take a gamble on you. Lover again. What in the world is going on? Secret lover. Moon lover. 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 We got lover out three doggone times. Gambler. Storyteller. Femme fatale. Alchemist. So you could literally have three different... Um, admirers at this time that's yeah okay <sighs> hold on because I'm just like what in the world what in the world lovers I'm going to clarify these three lover cards multiple times because I need to get to the bottom of this rebel is clarifying lover here for crossed ace of cups journey occupation detective so there could be a lover to someone else that was your lover that is investigating you father there's a father being investigated hermit something's being found out well 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 what is this okay lovers this could be some sort of scandal that's being publicized. Engineer guy. So see, with this engineer and this seven of swords, this is certainly some sort of, um, I don't want to say plot because that sounds too nefarious, but there's some strategy going on. Someone is really trying to figure out how to come toward you. They want to give to you. This is a charitable person, someone that's going to be very supportive of your endeavors in your life, but they just aren't sure how to reach you. They're nervous. Guy, mystic. They're nervous about your um, mystic abilities, your alchemy, child wounded. They could be going through some childhood wounds, could be dealing with a child who is... Uh, having some difficulties. Okay, I gotta get these cards because I want more intel on these these lovers cards. Lover, why is lover here? Secret lover. This person is moving toward you in secret with a vengeance. Lover, uh oh, what we got? What is this? You have a very high tolerance for physical pain. Man, what the hell? I am forever altered by your energetic authority, and I am grateful to God for your gifts. Clarifying lover here. We have gift here that's sideways. Number 17 is the star card in the tarot. So if you've been going through a very difficult time this person is aware that you have a high tolerance for instability okay they admire that they want to gift you with something they feel that you have your stamina your ability to tolerate discomfort has altered this wealthy man's energy and they see you as a mystic as a guide as an authority as far as spirituality is concerned and they want to help you in your material world secretly they could already be helping you secretly and you don't know it hmm all right well let's get a car for lovers here my brain is like whirling right now, going in a million directions. This person's a thinker. He thinks a lot. He thinks a lot. What is this? They pretend to not be greedy, but they are Scorpio. And it landed on poverty in the reverse. But that's clarifying lovers here. So this is a greedy person. Could be a Libra Sagittarius. So this is another person. One, two, three. Let's see what we get for this lovers here. You got three 
energies that want to get with you. Three. You are a hot commodity. What is this? He believes, girl, he believes he can't live without you. Girl, you better run. <laughs> I told you. Oh, my God. Oh, I just snorted. I hate it when that happens. Latest big news story is a false flag. It landed over here with a wealthy man. Be careful who you allow into your home. Now is not the time to, to take in stray. So don't let nobody in your house right now. But this wealthy man could be embroiled in some sort of scandal. Spirit is saying that this is a, a false scandal. Something's been made up, but it is being investigated. And or this is always my like little global card where, you know, there are certain things playing out in the media that by all appearances seem real, but there's some trickery. This is the third lever. So you got three energies. Could be past life, soulmate, karmic, Blu-ray. I mean, it's these energies are all over the place, but there is a lot of attention still on you. That's been the theme too, so... But uh, you might have already ran from this person. They're not giving up on you. So that's what I have for this reading, you guys. I will see you soon.